My name's Matt Kenyon, and I'm one half of Swamp, um, which I co-founded with Doug Easterly. And Swamp stands for Studies of Work Atmospheres in Mass Production. And we've been working together, uh, let's see, uh, we've been working together for 12 years now. In Spore, Home Depot, the corporation, uh, is responsible for the life of the plant or the product that it uh, sells at its stores. And um, if the stock value of the corporation goes up, the plant receives water. Onboard electronics um, check uh, for the weekly stock report. And uh, if the stock goes up, then it activates a series of mechanics that um, water the plant. Um, and if the stock fails to go up, the plant receives no water. And Home Depot has an interesting, uh, as a corporation, an interesting uh, sort of adaptive strategy to try to push its competition out of the market. And that strategy is that it guarantees the life of all of the plants it sells for one year. <clears throat> so if the plant dies for any purpose whatsoever, uh, Home Depot will replace the plant free of charge. And so in this case, the, um, this, uh, the object spore uh, provides a, a sort of uh, a feedback system between the, uh, the market, the corporation, and the life forms that it sells. With our project, we're really interested in the sort of large cybernetic systems, these sort of artificial systems. And the largest one that really comes to mind um, uh, are the sets of artificial life that control the economy, like these uh, computers that uh, sell stocks and move uh, uh, wealth around uh, uh, in a completely virtual and effortless sort of way. And so, um, so for us, uh, sort of giving that sort of that artificial intelligence of the market, uh, real sort of physical presence, uh, in a really empathetic way through the body and the flesh of this plant was a really important. That was a really important part of it.